We need to look at our cities in a new perspective. That's because urban living is the reality for the majority of people. And when we talk about our cities, we often talk about the infrastructure that connects them, the airports, the ports, the highways, and we think about their place in the global trade system. And we love categorizing cities. There are 40 or so mega cities. Those are cities with population of over 10 million, places like Tokyo, Jakarta, Shanghai, New York, Paris, Mexico City. And then there's another 600 cities that function as dynamos powering the global economy. But we shouldn't forget the thousands of smaller cities and towns, perhaps where you live, that are sometimes winners and losers as a result of globalization. We live in the urban century. Cities are facing major changes. We've got climate change. They're also facing post-industrial restructuring, a whole variety of different shifts that are happening in the post-digital world. To face these challenges, we do need a new framework for the way in which cities can navigate through into the future. And what we'll be presenting throughout this course is an ethical framework for cities. This includes addressing the 10 principles of the United Nations Global Compact. These span human rights, fair work, sustainability, and also, of course, anti-corruption. With these kinds of uh, ways of seeing the city, uh, we can assist cities to navigate new ways into the future, which will ensure their long-term sustainability. In this course, we introduce the idea of the ethical city. And we look at it from four perspectives. That's leadership, planning, how the local business environment works, and your role as the engaged ethical citizen. And we share with you the idea of the ethical lens, which is a device that you can use to make visible the unethical practices that at times weaken city governance and undermine urban development. So we filmed this course at various locations throughout the city. And you'll notice that it, the scenes are full of noise and color and people moving around. It's just the fact of life of how cities are. And really the city is the central character in our narrative. And we recognize that we shape the city and we are shaped by it. And what we'd like you to do now is tell us about who you are and where you live. But also tell us what you think about the ethical city. What's your impression? And don't worry, there's no uh, right or wrong answer. And we'll revisit what you said later in the course. For me, the ethical city is a city that cares. It cares about the big picture and how the city performs in the global economy. But it also cares about the small picture. And that's making sure that everybody benefits from the wealth and prosperity that the city generates.